Jesus died for you to save you from your sin. You know that? From the power of sin, whether it be fornication, homosexuality, whatever it is, Jesus can set you free. You guys ready for Jesus? He wants to set us free from our sin, whether it be fornication, homosexuality. Jesus loves all. He, yeah, he wants to set you free from your sin, you know? Yeah, I mean, I am. We love sinning. I love sinning. He wants to set us free from our sin. Jesus died for you, live for him, not sin. Sin is what destroys us, sexual sin, drunkenness, whatever it is. Jesus can set you free by the power of the Holy Spirit. Do you guys believe in Jesus? Absolutely. That's great. Jesus died for you, live for him. God is always real, but I'm, I don't believe in God. He's real. Even if you don't believe in him, he's real. Jesus can set you free from that sin that Everybody so easily ensnares us. Everybody. Jesus wants, has died for you on the cross to save you from your sin. From the fornication, the homosexuality. I, what's it about? What's it about? I don't. I want. I encourage people to actually stay sober. Jesus can set you free from the power of sin. God does not want us getting high. God wants us getting sober. Sober-minded. You guys believe in Jesus? Of course. Are you ready for Jesus? Of course. My you, father's a pastor. Is he? Yeah, but you guys shouldn't be out here condemning people. Oh, we want people to get... Show God's love. We're, I'm showing love. I just want people to get saved. I, I just want people to get saved. Saved from the wrath to come. Turn to Jesus. Give your life to him before it's too late. Homosexuality, fornication, whatever it is, Jesus can set you free from sin. Give you power over sin. Hell is real, only Jesus saves. Put your faith in Jesus. Read the Bible. You've got to read the Bible. Sex, sex is not the most important thing in this life. Amen. The most important thing is for you to turn to Jesus before it is too late. Tomorrow is not promised. Hallelujah. Tomorrow is not promised, people. We, we are living in very uncertain times. But God's word, God's word is certain. God's word, it never returns void. God, God is perfect in all of his ways. Jesus wants to set you free. God wants to set you free. God wants to the power of sin. You must be born again to enter the kingdom of God. Born again. You must be born again to enter the kingdom. We're born into sin. Slavery to sin. Jesus can set you free. To have a homosexual lifestyle or a lesbian lifestyle, you'll never be happy. It is. We're literally already happy. But how about holy? God wants us holy. So many holes. So many holes. It's the worst. I'm going to hell. Well, I'm going to pray for you guys to, to be turning to the Lord. Jesus died for you. Are you ready for him? He's real though. Do you, do you believe he died for you? Is he, he is real. Come to Jesus. We're here to encourage you to come to him. Come to Jesus. He can set you free. Yes, sir. You guys want to want to tell me what you think about Jesus? What do you think? Of, I, I have been. That's why I'm here. Oh, well, I'm I'm very I'm coming out in my belief, you know. I want you guys to get saved too. He can set you free. Okay, okay. Well, Jesus died for you. Live for Him. You guys believe in Jesus? Uh, I believe in what I believe in. Right. Thank you. Jesus can set you free. Jesus is is there for us to free us from our sin problem. We all have a sin problem. Jesus wants to set us free from that problem. He's the only one that can give us the solution. Relationships, sexual relationships must be based on God's word. Marriage is for man and woman. 
We should not be turning against God. God can forgive us for our sin, cleanse us of all unrighteousness. Put your faith in Him. You are going against the ways of God with, with this LGBTQ lifestyle. And God will judge you if you stay in those Please pray for us as we pray, preach this event. This is a big gay pride event in LA. But we're hoping and praying these seeds will bear much fruit and that many will remember what we've shared and turn to the Lord. Thanks for your prayers. Please pray God protects the brothers out here that we stay bold and that many will turn to Jesus before it's too late. Thank you so much for your prayers and support. I'm going to keep preaching. We're going to keep preaching for quite a while, I'm sure. May God bless you all. You see, of course, kingdom always.